Hello everyone, welcome to the channel and this is going to be your daily tarot reading May 3rd, 2018. Four card spread, the first one shows the topic of the day and this is going to be the Ace of uh, Pentacles. The second card that shows us uh, things that we need to stand against during that day or usually it's named what we should restrain ourselves of doing. That will be the star card. <clears throat> Then the third one is what is going to help you or the things we should go for during the day, things we, we should do during the day uh, or what needs to be done. This is the Six of Cups. And the last one is the result in case these two are uh, kept, these two conditions are kept into a positive aspect. This is going to be the Tower card. So even though we do have the Tower card, the last card is always red positive in case these couple conditions are uh, kept. So <clears throat> what we have for today as an aspect that is the Ace of Pentacles and obviously Ace of Pentacles is a, a very positive card. It does show for a, a slowly emerging new beginning that that promises a, a certain position or stability because the Pentacles is always about stability either through money you know either through secure position in either our job or into our relationship building up trust growing trust you know uh, in, in general it does speak for success into one business and as well harmony into one relationship but as well it's very important to know that the ace of the, the ace of pentacles is slowly developing card it takes months to really see uh, the <clears throat> the profits that you may gain from that particular day and that's why we do have the star card which uh, into a negative position or rather into things we should not do and one of these things that we should not do is place a, a great hope side whatever it is unfolding for that particular day let me give you an example let's say that today you meet someone who asks for your number you know and you're quite thrilled because you like the guy or the girl <clears throat> and because they ask for your number you kind of um, bias to yourself that they're gonna call you tomorrow and ask you for a date and they may not call for a couple of weeks or for a month as well so don't uh, go uh, or don't Im implement in your world and justified hopes guys but just on the contrary here with the six of cups the card says that you need to go with the flow go go you know as things come in your way and deal with them all <clears throat> So don't be uh, premeditated about your expectations and as well don't place big expectations upon especially people because the star card as well is about support and is about unfolding love which means that the love is going to unfold but slowly as we said you don't you cannot expect that it's going to happen over a night here the star card into that particular position <clears throat> as well mean that you may not have the means necessary in order to see the fullness of the situation or the fullness of the project which means that some some things uh, <clears throat> some facts you know and enterprises may stay hidden for you just one second because uh, my camera is running out of juice to put it on a charger here I had no idea that it's gonna happen that fast I'm sorry guys, it's just running out of juice. There we go, we are set. All right, <clears throat> so, <clears throat> yeah, I was about to tell you that the star card is, um, is a card which as well develop as slowly and as well it gives you a clarity upon situations. It is kind of like a, a, a able to lift yourself above it and see it through the eyes of an eagle and somehow um, right now the situation seems that it's not developed in a certain state where you can foresee everything and forewarn yourself with everything that being said you may bias yourself by a certain facts that you think are facts but they are not exactly facts which means that you may reach a, a wrong conclusion that being said people who are living for the moment will have tremendous 
um, <clears throat> day and tremendous experience through the day they will really be able to indulge themselves with the small things in life and the small happiness in life because this day shows guys that the good things happen step by step they develop slowly I mean bad things hap bad things are happening instantly <clears throat> And you have to strain yourself from those bad things, but instead of really uh, try to be attached more into the small things in life, which gives you happiness, like the smile of your coworker, you know, you know, by the accolades given by your boss as well, uh, <clears throat> by the gesture made from your. Um, girlfriend or a boyfriend, etc., etc., and as well the card. Uh, the six of cups here also points that you need to be more creative don't go with a certain plan today i mean uh, and this completely fits with the conjunction of these couple of cards saying that you need to go with the flow go along as it comes to you so uh, being playful will give you today much greater perspective it will pay off in a much bigger way as well <clears throat> and also it will make you experience the day like a child what i mean is that spontaneous uh, carefree as well and that uh, you will have much of a joy what you can came up with uh, dwelling yourself into your creativity and pulling the resolutions of the issues that you may face today out of it so uh, the day itself is going to be very fluid and uh, you will not lack activities all right but in the same time as I said these activities will not look like that they are very faithful activities although they are because we do have at the end the tower card and what will be the result of today in case I will run through the cards again so in case you catch on this slowly developing new beginning you know and you don't go biased about its uh, its unfoldment and uh, its ending for what I mean is that the ending of the cycle here but you go with the flow without placing unjustified hope unjustified hopes into it and especially one more thing I forgot to tell to mention about the star card is that you need to count mostly on yourself because the star card is also about support and if you expect that um, you know that you have to be carrying on someone to hold your hand while you are doing whatever you are doing here with the Ace of Pentacles. Uh, it's it ain't gonna work very well for you guys. So uh, you need to throw yourself into the activities that you are very confident in you can deal with them on your own and so you keep that condition and then you go with the flow and just take on whatever comes in your way one by one you know without a, a certain plan but being playful being creative and <clears throat> being capable to enjoy you know every small single happiness coming into your way like as I said the smile of your coworker, the accolades etc etc then what happens further into the future probably probably after a couple of months to six months here because the tarot card is about a six month prediction mostly to a year if a question specifically asks it then you are going to be able to take control upon a very big transformation in your life so we do have a, a stable <coughs> rather like an open opportunity slowly developing to a point where you can totally transform your life into a, a very positive thing because um, <clears throat> the tower card is not just about going through a havoc and a turmoil and experiencing bad things happening the tower is also about purging negativity all right it is a, about <clears throat> pushing away extinguishing bad people from your life bad influence from from your life you know a, an, a noxious activities as well a career paths that simply do you wrong people that are making you feel bad as well etc etc and <clears throat> this is all thanks to the fact that you're going to realize that on your own you can be creative that you can draw happiness from every single small things that happening around you as well you will be very confident in your own personal capabilities here as you haven't been depending on someone else's to, to hold your hand along the way that being said you're gonna stay strong and you simply will be able to say no to somebody that it is trying to infiltrate and take control upon your situation or maybe upon your entire life so it's kind of like this reading it's kind of like a, a wake-up call here 
for every single one of us for today to realize that no matter how <clears throat> worthless you may feel you are in certain areas in your life you are about to realize that uh, when you are pushed to your very limits <clears throat> all right you virtually there is nothing that you cannot do and you alone can take control upon your life that being said this was uh, your daily tarot reading for may 3rd 2018 i hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video rat signing out now see you next time bye <laughs>